my friends are since. It's a nice bright sunny afternoon here in Scotland and I am cycling into our band's studio because the band are playing called Closet Organ. I've got a gig tonight. I'm going in a bit early because I need to sort out my pedal board and also restring a guitar. This is the last gig we've got before our tour around the UK in a few weeks. So if you're anywhere near any of those dates, you should come along and say hello uh, so that I can feel like I've not wasted my life. I've arrived at the studio and I was going to do a nice video but I've turned up and this prick is here so I can't do anything. He's ruined it! He's ruined it all! I'm trying to make us famous, Hagee. What's mess. wrong with your amp? Nothing, it should have a clean fucking bill of health. How long have you been waiting to get this fixed? <laughs> Three years. Professional band. I've taken the strings off this guitar only to discover that unfortunately the middle pickup here as you can maybe see is um, fallen in and the screw is no longer connected which means that um, fuck I might just use a different guitar ah shit I've decided to let Hagee fix the guitar, which might be a mistake. Look how fucking complicated that is. What kind of fucking switch is this? The work of Mad Malky. Mad Malko in the cheese guitar. <laughs> so I've decided to give up on stringing the guitar at the moment and instead fix my pedal board. So this is a kind of current setup. Um, I've basically got the signal comes into my tuner. It then goes into the clone here. It's just a clone clone. Obviously, I don't have one of those £5,000 original clones. That is my kind of standard overdrive. I just leave that on all the time. It then goes into these two, which are pitch effects. I've got one kind of whammy ricochet for octave up. I've got this one, which is another sub and up, which is an octave pedal as well. And then I have two different effects loops. The first effects loop engages my Big Muff Pie, which is the kind of op amp Big Muff for that nice Siamese Dream Smashing Pumpkins gish type sound and then the second one is nested inside this one so if i turn this one on it engages this which is a harmonic percolator from pedalparts.co.uk and also this chorus pedal from all blood noise endeavors this is a reflector i love this had it for a long time and these two together form a kind of lead tone then at the end of the chain i've got this thing which is an mwfx judder and i use that for noise and weird sounds and i need to pull all of these off because what i'm going to do is replace both of the effects loops with one of these single abc boxes and then what i'll do is i'll have my main tone on c i'll have my kind of lead which will be these two on a and then i'll have my kind of distortion on b and that should hopefully simplify everything a bit so Steve, yes. how long do you think this will take before it fails? Probably immediately. This power supply, I don't know what the individual current draw is for each of these. <laughs> and <laughs> these pedals require 300. So... Uh, that, yeah, that's not going to be enough. So we have the new pedal board. New pedal board. Fresh cable in. Looks a bit tidier. <laughs> I can't believe you bought a, ra a Rainmaker pedal. So my plan was to use this guitar but I took all the strings off and um, I've forgotten how to put them back on. Yeah. Look at this! <laughs> it's a work art. It's a fucking work art. Fuck me. Right, <laughs> let's get. Oh! <laughs> what then? <laughs> oh, play me.
There's been an incident. How does that happen? <laughs> I almost took your eye out. You could have been blinded. Obviously, the power that came <laughs> off with was to deflect off that into the back of my head. <laughs> How many strings you got to go? Uh, three. <laughs> Give me your review, nice. mid-set yeah. review. Steven, um, shut the up. Did that and I'm very, very sorry. <laughs> So I think um, only Two thanks for, for but men of a particular stature. the biggest monitor you've ever had? It absolutely is. <laughs> biggest but, monitor of I mean, your career? I mean, if we're talking off camera. <laughs>